Hello friends, Ben here for Giant Loop. Today I'm very excited to show you all of the products or many of the products that we sell that integrate seamlessly with the new Mojave Saddlebag, allowing you to use it as the base for your adventures, whether you're wanting to go moto camping, day tripping, multi-day, single day, carry extra fuel, carry extra water, whatever it is, we have a product that'll fit and it all integrates seamlessly. This is the all new Mojave Saddlebag, but a lot of what I'm gonna tell you today will also work with the original Mojave Saddlebag, but let's walk through some of the ways that you can attach additional products to this Mojave Saddlebag without extra mounting straps or anything required to the motorcycle. First up, let me show you all the ways you can use the webbing loops. Keep in mind, I'm gonna show you a bunch of giant loop products, but you can also strap like an ax or a pair of shoes I've done before, a little soft-sided cooler, whatever. It works with all of this, but I'm gonna just give you a couple examples of Giant Loop products that work well. So I'm just gonna use pronghorn straps. Got a couple 25-inch pronghorn straps here, and obviously these are just webbing loops, so they just go through the webbing loops, and then we're ready to add additional things. So I'll just put one on each side. Okay, pronghorn straps are in. Say you wanna carry extra water, because you're going out on a long trip all day or a multiple day, no problem. One gallon Giant Loop Cactus Canteen. Strap it on using the pronghorn strap. Tighten it down like this. I just like to run the strap back through. You could actually print, maybe do this with the 18 inch pronghorn. Same on this side, through the convenient reflective webbing loops on the cactus canteen. And voila, as we say in the business, that ain't going anywhere. But maybe it's not water you need. Maybe you're riding a bike like this 450L I just literally did this out in the desert when I was in the Mojave Desert for the Get On ADV Fest. I only have a three gallon tank. We went out on a 150 mile ride and I wasn't sure if I was gonna make it. So I brought an extra gallon of fuel with me. And that was incredibly easy because I just used a Giant Loop one gallon armadillo bag. Same thing, it's got the loops. You put the loops in the pronghorn strap. There's one gallon of gas in here right now. Tighten that down, run your strap back through. You're good to go, same on the bottom. Extra gallon of gas attached to the back of the bag. When this is done, pour it in the bike, uh, roll it up, throw it in one of the side pockets here of the Mojave. Cool, that's all well and good, but what if I need first aid supplies? We got you covered there too, because we have the Giant Loop First Aid Possibles pouch. There's webbing loops on the sides of this, as you can see, up through, put it through. It's the same thing, you just saw me do it, okay? Tire changing kit, just as easy, because I keep mine in a Giant Loop Possibles pouch, same thing. Webbing loops on the side, around, through, attached with a pronghorn st strap. These uh, Possible's pouches actually come with traditional webbing straps and buckles. You can do it that way, whatever's easiest for you. So you want a little more storage. So you wanna turn this into a light moto camping setup. I've been camping with my buddy Nathan who did exactly that. Let me show you how to add another 20-ish liters to this setup. This is gonna blow your mind, but you continue using pronghorn straps, but you just add the Giant Loop Rogue bag these orange pronghorn straps are 32 inches long and they're great for bigger bags like that. But what's cool is you don't have to attach any of this to your bike. There's no finding more mounting points on your bike because the Mojave is already secured to the bike. You just secure these things to the Mojave and you're good to go. See the webbing on top through that into the buckle. Easy peasy, squeezy of citrus, preferably yellow lemon is what I'm referring to. Okay, problem solved. Let me put the other one on, I'll give you a wider view. Now that is about 30 liters of storage with the additional 18 from the Rogue bag with the 12 of the Mojave. And it's still completely out of your way, still sits right here, no problem. You got lots of room to move around on the bike. But what if you want even more storage? What if you want to run the Rogue, but also add a first aid possibles pouch to one side and a tire changing kit to the other? That's impossible, right? Nope. The new Mojave is specifically designed to allow you to add additional possibles pouches to the outside. Let me show you how. First, remove the compression strap. You're gonna wanna loosen that because you're gonna need the whole thing in a minute. Pronghorn straps are actually my preferred mounting method, but with the possibles pouches, you don't even really need them. They come with webbing straps, extra webbing straps, but I'm just gonna demonstrate pronghorns because it's how I do it. Anyway, through the bottom, through the top. I'm gonna do that for both of them. Make sure I have all my slack on the top there. Same here, I'm gonna come through the bottom, over through the top loop here. And I'm just gonna put my first aid possibles pouch on top of that. Through, through, and 
through here, tighten it down. Oh yeah, room to spare, room to spare. I'm gonna undo this buckle just so I can get it nice and tight. But you see how I'm just attaching it to the top of this? Right through the webbing on the side, through the buckle on the bottom, just compresses both bags so nothing's bouncing around. It's all already attached to the bike because it's just attaching to the Mojave. I don't need any additional straps to the motorcycle, nothing like that. Put this buckle back on and then I'm just gonna take my compression strap. This is why we give you extra length in the compression strap is for this very purpose. Over the top, make sure it's all the way out. I'm just gonna buckle this on, look. Hook it on, tighten it down and that, I just doubled my storage on that side and it's still out of my way and I have my possibles pouch. I can access the top of both of these bags easy enough to just open it, get in, get the contents out. I can do that with the one underneath. I can still get into my Rogue dry bag. It is super easy to add additional storage to these new Mojaves. And we think that's one of the coolest features because we just want all of our gear to work together. We want to give you maximum versatility to take the amount of gear that you think you need without having to take a bag that's partially empty or whatever. Probably the easiest additional bag to add to the new Mojave is the Klamath Tail Rack Pack because you already have a pronghorn strap running underneath either to your tail rack, like the giant loop tail rack here, to the fender hooks or just up underneath the tail of your bike. Instead of just tightening down as much as you can on top of the Mojave, you can just take that loose end and the Klamath has two has holes in the bottom exactly for this, designed for this strap. So for the purposes of this demonstration, let's just pretend like I don't have this tail rack on here, even though we highly recommend it. It's the easiest way to mount this and they're not expensive. I'm just gonna take my pronghorn strap I'm gonna run it down through the Klamath bag, through the hole, there's a hole made for this. I'm gonna go into the hole in the Mojave, the mounting hole. I'm just gonna go under the tail of my motorcycle, all the way under, pull this tight, okay? Back up, through the hole in the Mojave, designed for this again, through the hole in the Klamath, and then I actually don't even think I needed this orange strap. I could have done it with a 25 inch, but we're here now. I'm gonna tighten this down inside the bag, buckle it off. And my Klamath tail bag is essentially mounted already. Now you can do the same thing again. There's another set of holes here. Go around the tail of the bike again, or you could run it like this. Or if you have the tail rack, it's exactly the right size to go through the tail rack. But you just put the lid on. It's very easy to add this Klamath tail pack. And it's essentially like having a tank bag on the back of your bike. So those are just a few ways that you can use the new Mojave as the basis for a modular motorcycle packing system, whether it's day trips, you're trying to get out and do an ultralight moto camp, or even with the bigger bags, less ultralight setup out for motorcycle camping pretty easily, particularly if you're running a full-size tank bag and the zigzag, you can put a fender bag on. So there's lots of options, but that's what's so great about this Mojave is because of all the attachment points that are included on purpose. It works with so many other bags. So I'm gonna link all these for you in the description so you can check them out and think about how you might wanna set up your Mojave or just get a Mojave and then think about where you'd like extra storage and go from there. Make sure that you check out the product video I did on the new Mojave so you can learn about all the upgrades and new features of the brand new bag with the roll top design, top loading. It's like it, we took a really great design and made it even better. So we're really proud of it. We hope you really like it. Don't forget that all these products are backed by our lifetime warranty and that all orders over $75 from giantloopmoto.com ship for free. Please consider subscribing to the channel for more tips and tricks, gear overviews, product announcements, monthly promos, and other great content. And don't forget that all YouTube subscribers save 10% on giantloopmoto.com with promo code subscriber. Thank you for watching. Go light, go fast, go far with Giant Loop.